Dude, where's the steering wheel? <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> All right, we made it. We are at the Brunsfield Lynx Golf Society. <sighs> no sleep. No. Really. But who needs sleep? Adrenaline is gonna get us through this one. That's it. Let's find some coffee. Let's find some coffee. Get changed into some actual golf clothes and go play golf. Brunsfield Lynx Golfing Society. Check this out. The origin of the society dates back to 1761 when members played over five holes at Brunsfield Lynx, where golf has been played since the 15th century. Wow. It says the society is the fourth oldest golfing body in the world and celebrated its 250th anniversary in 2011. It's incredible. It's one good drive, he's trash talking already. You gotta, <laughs> trash you gotta, you talking. You gotta keep it interesting right out of the gate. Gotta go. Come on, go. Gotta go. Just In hold out. Ball. Did you just hold out? Hold out. All right, I can't remember the last time I got to do this. Pin collect, zero, <laughs> zero putts. Nice job, dude. From the bunker, never seen that before from you. Cause I never do it. <laughs> First hole off the plane and I hole out from the greenside bunker, something I never do. So it doesn't matter what else I do today, I can sleep well on that. And now I gotta go find my ball in these trees. guys here we are Scotland first round of the trip a couple of holes in actually playing pretty well for being pretty jet-lagged didn't sleep too much on that flight it was an overnight red-eye flight so left at night got here in the morning yeah I'm sure I'm gonna crash later tonight but uh, we're out here on the course having fun so par 5 third shot about 140 and let's try to make a birdie in Scotland first birdie here it comes calling it now middle Wind in our face, a little elevated. Definitely some elevation. Yep, so we're gonna play an extra club. I, I played I get... one extra too. Yeah. Are oh, we gonna play seven? You know what, I'm gonna play a soft six here. You know, so. Give it the old soft six. Get up. Oh, I keep leaking them out now. Leaking. It's all right, you'll be up there by that green side bunker. All right, I finally hit a drive in position A, so we're gonna try not to put this approach in position Z. That looks good. All right, You're right about that extra club. Position B, we'll take it. <laughs> They 
got in his head. I know what I'm about to say is going to jinx us, but we didn't come here for sunshine. Dude, why'd you, why you say that? <laughs> Blue skies? Yeah. I feel like we're back home. That's great. Look at it. It's beautiful. Hasn't even found his ball yet, and he just said he's going to up and down this. <laughs> from, from in here somewhere. Oh, look at it, look at it, look at it. Wait, hold on. <laughs> what would you give me to up and down this? Come on. Should I hit a five iron out of this? <laughs> Driver. Very good. I got you at... Let's see, 109 from there. Probably like 130. He's gonna grab that club, right? I'll say so. That was an aggressive prediction. Calling up and down still. Yeah. Pretty par four here downhill. 379 yards. Bunkers in front of that green. Driver? Yeah. Wow, this 10th hole, what a pretty hole this is. I've got 40 yards. Yeah, look at this. How are you feeling right now? I'm feeling good, I got a second win. 12 holes in, just got off the plane, what, three, four hours ago? I'm about to hit a wall, I feel it coming, but. Come on, you had five coffees before we came out here. That's true. Let's go. It's not working though. All right, listen. This should make you feel good, you're in the middle of the fairway. Par three, five. 310, just wanna hit a what, 200? Driver off the deck, let's go. <laughs> Woo. Got that nice added burst of wind right before you hit it too. Look at this, he's got planes landing, he has wind at his back, in his face, no sleep, yet he's striping hybrids down there. The plane inspired me, I just took it off. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this does not happen often. I have a legitimate shot at back-to-back -back birdies here. Let's see if I can make a putt. Ooh, my legs are sore. All right, I've officially determined that the best way to beat any type of jet lag is just come out and play golf. In the sun, get some uh, walking in. No, we went straight from the plane. Ooh, it's getting windy now. Went straight from the plane to the course. After this, drive over to St. Andrews, about an hour drive from here. Get something to eat, crash, and we got two rounds of golf tomorrow. Get a little bit of rest and get back at it. It's 
five. I can't, I'm so tired. I can't even add five, ten, fifteen. You That's, fell asleep on the thing. Sixteen. Ninety to eighty-four. Man, I wish I can get some of those sevens back. One, two. We got nine more rounds of golf this week. We'll get it back. Yep. All right. So next stop, drive to St. Andrews, which they're telling us is about an hour drive from where we are right now. Get some rest, and then go back at it again tomorrow morning. We'll be on the lookout for that. Finally got that fish and chips. Finally got it, man. Finally. Right? Yeah. Phenomenal. Finally.